to Saturday, clouds with occasional rain. High tomorrow, 36 to 41. Low tomorrow night, 34 to 39. The high Saturday, 42 to 47. Clouds and rain on Sunday, the high 39 to 44. For AccuWeather, <laughs> I'm Steve Williams. All right, we're, we're a little more uh, doom and gloom than he is. Winter weather advisory in effect beginning at 8 o'clock tonight. Small craft advisory in effect beginning at 1 o'clock today. Rain today. And then freezing rain tonight, rain and snow, freezing rain, ice, uh, basically your terrible driving conditions. Uh, the two key words for the next couple of days are going to be be careful. So uh, we'll, we'll just sit back, watch, and see. Right now there's only rain out there. All right. Uh, it, it's no surprise that according to U.S. Census, home ownership rate increased during the pandemic. Not only that, but the folks that are at home are doing more at home. And from the dailylounge.com, Bob Ganey's with us. Bob, good morning. Hey, good morning, Neil. Thanks for having me. Okay. I I didn't know I had you there for a second. Listen, um, with everybody everybody staying home, what, what kind of new trends are you seeing in home improvement? Well, it's definitely, you know, the kitchens and the bathrooms. Those seem to be the spots that you need to focus on if, if you want to make sure you have that return on investment. But also, uh, you know, COVID-19 has made sure that we're spending a whole bunch of more time in both those rooms in our home. So, you know, one of the things from COVID, and I'm sure you probably reported on the national toilet paper shortages that happened and, and everything else. Well, that highlighted our need to transition away from toilet paper to using bidet toilets. Now, Toto's new Aquia 4 Arc Washlet Plus C5 Bidet Toilet uses pure, clean water to leave you feeling clean and refreshed. It's got a heated seat, so I, I heard those weather advisories, those winter weather advisories out there. So, <laughs> you know, you go into your bathroom, you can have a heated seat for you. It's got a different temperature setting. There's even a wireless remote, and I happen to love it. It's got the clean Synergy bowl cleaning technology. It's got pre-mist spray to the Dynamax whoa, 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 whoa. tornado whoa, flush system. Do, which What do I need a wireless yeah. remote for a toilet seat for? Oh, buddy, there there are more uh, features to this toilet seat than uh, some people have in their car. This is spectacular. <laughs> you can just sit there with a the remote in your hand. You can operate and, and make sure that, uh, you know, you're you're feeling nice and refreshed and clean as a whistle. Can, can I have the remote outside the door and, like, when my grandson's sitting there, just <laughs> surprise him and make him go up, make it go up and down? I happen to know that that is you can actually operate it <laughs> standing, you know, maybe in a different area, but uh, you know, not advisable. I guess it's not advisable for uh, people's, you know, uh, relaxing time on the throne. <laughs> so, so in the how extensive are people getting in the kitchens? What like what's new in the kitchen that I can install? Well, we got. Yeah, well, I'll tell you, there, there are tons of things going on in the kitchens right now, but one of the things that I happen to love, we have uh, cabinets that, you know, upgrading your kitchen cabinets is another great way to give your home a fresh new look. Now, Cobra cabinets, they're American-made. They give you custom-designed cabinets at store-bought prices. They harvest the wood. They design, construct, finish, and assemble high-quality cabinetry. And Cobra fuses American craftsmanship with European minimalism and modern finishes. You work with their project manager, their designers. They're engineers, and you capture what you want your Pacific's project to look like. And there are so many ways to customize. You can do roll-out shelves, cutlery inserts, pull-outs, tilt-outs, lazy Susans, trash can cabinets, all sorts of things. So you can have your dream kitchen at an affordable price. But really a, a, a real simple way to, to really upgrade your kitchen as well. LG knows that uh, you know we're spending a ton of time in the kitchen during these COVID days. And they have the InstaView door and door refrigerator. This is something, oh, Neil, you're going to yes. love this. I love this. So UV nanotechnology, so, so that means there's no, uh, it's going to reduce bacteria in the water dispenser. Dual ice maker with craft ice, so you can choose from cubed, crushed, or slow melting round craft ice for the bar quality experience. But it has the InstaView window, so it's so cool. You knock twice on the door. It illuminates the interior of the refrigerator, shows you what's in there. And then it has a door and door feature. So you can actually open a smaller door to grab what you want without having to open the full refrigerator. Really neat. Unbelievable. All right. I, I've got to ask, what is a slow melting ice cube? Well, the craft ice, the craft ice is really neat because it's really thick, solid, dense ice. 
And I don't know if you've ever seen those cocktails when you go to a, you know, well, back in the day when you could actually leave your house and go to a bar or a restaurant, <laughs> and you'd have the. Not, nowadays, we don't see these really neat craft ice, but it almost would seem like it was cut from a block of ice. So you'd have the, the craft ice cube sitting in the glass, and then you you'd you'd have your drink poured over it, and and as the craft ice cube would slowly melt, it would it basically add to that drink's refinement, so to speak. So that's wow. what craft ice is. It's just a different type of of ice it's it's still you know it's still water being really cold i mean you can't change ice in that regard but it's the type of ice cube that comes out that's really neat looking i i would assume that with the door the way it is we're talking about uh big time energy saving oh yeah definitely very energy efficient uh great to like like you said you know you're not opening and closing a full door so you're not losing you know that amount of the cold air that's inside your refrigerator when you open that that small door indoor feature you can access things really quickly and easily and for me it's great because i have a two-year-old running around who loves the refrigerator so i basically got that thing duct taped closed all the time so to be able to open something that he can't reach right now <laughs> awesome <laughs> yeah but he's always doing the double knock on the door i'll bet oh yeah no doubt about it he's blowing that thing up <laughs> Bob, that that is that is really cool stuff. What if if somebody goes to dailylounge dot com? What do we get there? Well, you can go check out everything we talked about today. There's even a, a room and board has a Kenwood, uh, a be beautiful Kenwood bathroom vanity there as well, and just all sorts of things that you can check out. But you can do a little more research on the items, and and you can actually uh, access different savings uh, mechanisms that are available for you and everything. So. A great way to view everything we talked about today and, and, and also to research some more items as well. Do you do your own home improvements or do you bring in somebody? You know, I, I used to host a bunch of shows on HD, HGTV and I got to know a lot of the carpenters really well and I learned oh. some tricks. So, yeah, there's some small things I'll do, but my brother-in-law used to say it best. He, he used to always say, man, I'd rather cut a check than cut the lawn. And, uh, <laughs> and I always thought that was pretty funny. So. I fall somewhere in between those two. You know, I'll do the easy stuff. I'll do. I'll take the low-hanging fruit. But when it becomes something that, uh, you know, is a skilled job, I'll hire it out and make sure it's done right. Listen, Bob, thank you very much. DailyLounge.com for more information. Yes, sir. All right. You have a great day. Where are we talking to you, by the way? Where are you? I am in Michigan. I'm in uh, Northville, Michigan today. What, what, what are they calling for you for weather? Or is it oh already passed you? Oh well, it, the 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 big front went past us, but man, we got hit hard. I mean, I I I, I have uh, you know I moved here from the West Coast. I moved. I, I'm from uh, Michigan originally, so I got to move back home to be closer to family. I'm so glad I did during the the COVID thing. And uh, but you know, this is my wife's first winter. She's a Southern California girl, so she's she's already seen me going out to shovel the snow probably ten times in the last three weeks <laughs> so she's three hours she's losing her mind yeah the last three hours yeah we got a dusting last night so but we probably got about six eight inches on the ground oh man listen be careful and as always it's a pleasure having you thanks for your time thank you sir thank you so much for having me i appreciate it all right bob ganey everybody it is uh